Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Travel Food Business Lifestyle Technology. Today I'm gonna give you uh, advantages of social distancing and also uh, what mask you have to uh, wear and uh, also uh, if you are affected by uh, COVID-19, what are the steps you need to go. So let's. So advantages of social distancing. So how do I practice social distancing? Let us go uh, in detail at first. Avoid handshake, hugs. Handshaking as a customary greetings enables virus transmission through skin to skin contact. Substitute something else, mild wave or uh, bumpy elbows. And avoid a lunchroom rush. Whether you eat lunch is the employee in the employee dining room or uh, cafeteria or restaurant avoid uh, the rush eat uh, earlier or later eat at home or eat with uh, just a few people in quiet area inside or out avoid using public pens public pens are found at uh, retail uh, counters at the building or hotel guest registration at the bank in uh, benefits office and many other uh, places Use your own pen in conference room. Don't use public whiteboard markers. Uh, carry your own. Avoid uh, com commuter uh, rush periods. If you commit via uh, public uh, transportation, take advantage of your employer's uh, flex time policy to shift your uh, working hours. Avoid time when you will uh, be exposed to crowd. Find a quiet uh, place. If you are at a bar, concert or other social venue, find the place that is not as crowded and sit there. Uh, you will uh, still have fun but you will uh, reduce the risk of becoming infected uh, if someone is sick. And uh, substitute tele-meetings uh, for face-to-face -face meetings. Reducing the number of duration of face-to-face -face meeting uh, reduces the opportunity for virus transmission. So shit as much as uh, the agenda as possible as email and teleconference. Use larger conference room. If you uh, must meet face to face, use the largest uh, available conference room. Larger uh, rooms have better uh, ventilation and there are more rooms to spread out. And why should I social distance myself? There are a number of reasons. During a pandemic everyone is susceptible to pandemic influenza and you cannot you could not then uh, transmit it to others or uh, more uh, value, valuable than you so small group are better than big groups because it reduces the risk of exposure people who are uh, less than three feet away from infected person they have the greatest uh, risk of infection and contaminated surface can transmit the influenza virus for 24 hours. People may not show signs and could be contagious and you can be contagious for 24 to 48 hours before the illness onset. People are more contagious when they are ill. After the, the onset of illness, adults are contagious for one week and children are contagious for uh, two weeks. What are the advantages of uh, social distancing? Uh, <clears throat> it slows and decreases transmission of influenza which limit the effect on individual plus schools, workplace and healthcare system. What are the disadvantages of social distancing? There are a cost to this method. Not only uh, the cost related to the loss of uh, school days and missed work and all the rest of obvious consequences but the loss of social uh, relationship which are a key to community uh, resiliences and the ability to get through an event which affect everyone at once. We can see this uh, if we uh, take the objective of social distancing to its logical conclusion. What if we all uh, hit away each from uh, everyone else? When social distancing remember to take it uh, to extreme and remove yourself from the world you still have to participate but do it in a safe way until pandemic clear.
people uh, have doubt uh, does social distancing really cure the disease no exactly not it will stop the uh, spread of the diseases and it, it will just reduce the spread amount of uh, spreadness if you maintain social distancing in uh, a public uh, so it is very good so that uh, even you are also not affected even others will also be not affected uh, so social distancing is a very important concept uh, when it comes to uh, influenza period so you can see in this image uh, so there is a six feet gap between uh, these two uh, people so that is uh, social distancing and uh, they are in a correct uh, position so that uh, the disease cannot uh, spread if uh, either of them have a diseases even uh, the disease cannot uh, the spread of disease is less so social distancing is a very uh, uh, advantage uh, for this uh, covid-19 uh, to slow down the spread of covid-19 you can also see the graph at first it is at high that is in green color and if you maintain social distancing it comes down it the flatten it flattens the curve this i have already shared in the uh, previous video i'll put in the card and also put in the description so you can see that and uh, so social distancing can reduce the spread of diseases it cannot uh, actually it can be around 50% cure but it will not cure the entire diseases you can just prevent the spread that is what i am going to tell in this video and another one important uh, point is that uh, covid-19 um spreads to everyone uh, and it doesn't uh, uh, mean that it will not affect uh, any uh, it will not affect uh, small people or uh, big people or any religious people it affects everyone and um, recently i heard that uh, in china it has affected the same person uh, again uh, so be very careful and uh, please uh, uh, make sure uh, prevention is better than cure and uh, to prevent it uh, you have to wash your hands and uh, using hand sanitizer maintain social distancing so if we do this uh, we can prevent it and uh, we can uh, cut the chain and we can also stop the uh, spread of the covid-19 i hope you all understand this so wearing uh, n95 uh, mask is uh, very uh, useful if you are going out uh, um, once in a week or uh, twice in a week uh, so n95 is advisable and if you are going daily uh, so you can wear n99 so what is the difference uh, in this so uh, n95 it is a it is a dust covering uh, mask and it uh, protects 95 percent from dust and uh, virus so it cannot enter and it is uh, in the shape uh, same of the uh, respiratory mask and uh, in respiratory mask you can you will have the what you can say uh, you'll have the uh, respiratory um, holes and uh, i will share you the image in that and uh, currently i don't have the stock in that so i have the n95 because i'm not uh, moving uh, uh, frequently out uh, sometimes uh, for short distances so this mask is enough and uh, it is advised you can wear n99 mask also because if you are going uh, daily on essential work or anything so you have to wear an N99 mask so it is very uh, protective and also N95 is also protective so you can wear both the mask uh, so this is made uh, of cotton it is very um, uh, soft and also uh, very uh, use uh, very useful to uh, wear uh, so I would recommend uh, N95 so you can even uh, buy uh, N99 uh, so it is left to you uh, so i'll put the image of n99 so these are the advantages in uh, two masks uh, so both the masks uh, have equal uh, resistance to protect you from covid-19 
is uh, kindly uh, call to the whatsapp number as given by the government and they will only come to your place and take the uh, sample and uh, please share this with your friend and there is nothing to panic and maintain social distancing at, uh, at every place you go thank you and see you all in another interesting episode of travel food business and technology until then bye bye for now